All right, the first Monday here of the week, and we are in the final day of winter is what I meant to say. But you know what? Record heat is going to be possible with higher humidity. So get ready for that. It's already heating up. A few storms possible later, and then a cold front is set to move through tonight. So right now, temperature is already in the upper 80s here in Miami and Fort Lauderdale and Key West. We're seeing some clouds beginning to build and currently temperatures in the mid to upper 80s all across South Florida with the heating of the day and plenty of moisture out ahead of this front that could help to fuel thunderstorms. Hence, the Storm Prediction Center has placed Broward under a level one, a limited risk of severe weather, meaning damaging winds, small hail, heavy downpours will be possible. Cold front is making its way here across parts of Central Florida, leading to some storms there. We are still quiet. And so as we head into this afternoon, we'll see the potential for a few showers and storms to develop that could produce some heavy downpours, some damaging winds, hail. And as we take a look going through the evening, there might be a few storms. Highs today will likely reach around 90 in Miami. That could tie or break the record. 89 in Fort Lauderdale. And really, it's just going to be hot and humid all around with temperatures well above normal. Feeling like the mid to upper 90s. Make sure you're staying hydrated. Drinking a lot of water, taking breaks, staying in the air conditioning when you can. Tomorrow morning, though, we'll have natural AC courtesy of this cold front. You may even break out a light sweater, light jacket as lows fall to the upper 60s in Broward and day low 70s across the keys so our storm tracker is showing us this first front moving through and then we have yet another storm system on the way look at what happens on friday what a mess right this is a vernal boundary and a low pressure area that's going to be pre plenty of moisture for friday and allow for the chance for widespread showers and storms meantime today 90 degrees the rain chances in high but where the storms form some could turn strong isolated severe spring officially begins tomorrow with a spring equinox it's takes place at 11.06 p.m. This is when the sun is directly above the equator and it's going to feel a little more like spring with lows in the upper 60s, highs in the upper 70s, 10% chance of rain, even cooler Wednesday morning with a low 60s, a high 79, beautiful and pleasant. And then by Thursday, we'll start to warm up lows in the upper 60s, the high 80 degrees Friday, turning soggy and breezy with a 70% chance of rain, then still some scattered storms Saturday, but drier and a little cooler by Sunday.